Um, my name is Sharon Jacob. Uh, I've been a speech and drama teacher for 18 years and I've been an educator for 20 years. Speech and drama to me is a lot of things. I think one, uh, it's definitely our collaboration with the Trinity College in London. Our teachers are trained, um, our teachers are mentored uh, to offer this world that um, is holistic to the children to embrace who they are. And I think that is so important for not just children but for individuals to know who they are. I find it really exciting to like, wake up every morning and be like, oh I gotta go for drama class. You know when you're playing as a bad person, then you can act like a bad person. Or when you're playing as a good person, you can act like a good person. And it's just like you're being different different things when you're acting, you're not just being that same person. It's really fun because also while doing speech and drama, you get to like play with the toys that are there and it's like being a child again. Because like in school and all we have work to do, but when we come here we get to relax. Every year we have um, moderations where we like we have a poem to read or a speech and we have lots of elements of drama and speech that we have to present to a moderator and it seems it's an it's like an exam but it doesn't seem like an exam because it's really fun and relaxed. Yeah. Sometimes we go to different topics around the world and about some serious things and some fun things. And I actually get to be myself in class. Before I went to speech and drama, I was quite quiet. As you can see, I'm not anymore. I was quite quiet and I felt insecure because I couldn't express what I was thinking and I was really scared to talk aloud in class and raise my hand and things like that. But now, with speech and drama, I think um, I'm more confident in myself and I basically take more risks. Drama has been really fun. I mean, not all of it has been fun. We've had moments of hard work, you know, writing down things, preparing for an exam. I can't ever say that preparing for an exam is fun because it's just really stressful. I get really stressed out. I, um, it's a lot of hard work too, but on the whole, drama has been really fun. It's, I've been in drama since I was, I don't know, four. And it's just really helped me grow. I mean, we used to go to drama land we used to pretend to be in different places. It was it was really good for me. It helped my imagination grow. It helped my reading because I love reading now. And it's just been this place where I can just go and be absolutely nuts. And that's fine. I mean, I'm nuts in most places, but this is like my hour of nuttiness in the week if I haven't been nuts anywhere else. Environment is a very important part of my life. Uh, and as for children, uh, because they're new to the world, being very safe of where they are gives them the confidence to grow into individuals that they want to be, individuals that they think they want to be. Uh, and by uh, working together with the safety that I provide for them, they know that um, this, this is a place where the teacher will encourage them that um, being who you are is the most important thing. Uh, and so there is no right, there is no wrong. We encourage, we take risk of every behaviour that you want to share with us. Speech and drama isn't really just a programme, it's really about developing your life skills. Because I truly believe that if an individual can be who they are, whatever they choose to do would be at their very best. So, yes, speech and drama is really about life skills. Dramatically different take two. Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one. Dramatically different. That's fantabulous. Yay. <laughs> oh my gosh.